Welcome back to another video. I'm your tech guide Wayne. Today I want to show you how to unlock your Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 5 so you can use it with any carrier. The first thing you'll need to do is go to the phone app and you're going to type in star pound zero six and pound. That's going to show us our IMEI. You'll want to write down this first number that shows up at the top. We're going to use that for the next step of the video. Next we're going to hit the home button and now we're going to go to Google Chrome to the website, theunlockingcompany.com, and we're just gonna fill out a few prompts. So first will be manufacturer, which will be Samsung. Next, the model, which is gonna be the Galaxy Z. So go all the way down to Galaxy Z. Keep going, keep going. Z Flip 5. And then we're gonna tap Unlock Now. And then here, the country that we purchased the phone in, which will be United States. Carrier is going to be AT&T. Here it's going to show you the price of what it's going to cost to unlock the phone. It's going to show you the delivery time, which is when they will, uh, the window of time that they will email you back in with the final unlocking instructions. Keep in mind that the process to unlock phones does vary from uh, time to time depending on the carrier and it does change pretty often so they're going to send you the most updated unlocking instructions so you can get your phone unlocked. You will need to enter the IMEI here as well. Tap add to cart and check out to start the process. Now a couple of things you need to be aware of is um, they will not unlock the phone if the phone is blacklisted and they will not unlock it if you owe a balance from a previous carrier. So. If you owe money on the phone and you're trying to go around that in order to unlock the phone, this website won't be able to help you, so keep that in mind. Now, a couple other things I want to point out. As we go to the top of the screen, there is a toll-free number you can call, text, there is an email address, and a WhatsApp number. So you have four different ways to contact the company if, for whatever reason, maybe you're outside of that delivery window and you still haven't gotten an email, or you have an issue with trying to unlock the phone. You can always reach out to their support in order to get your phone um, unlocked. Now, once the phone is unlocked, a couple of things you'll need to know. You'll want to have a SIM card of the service you'd like to use the phone with, and you'll want to have your SIM tool, which looks like this, so that you'll be ready to take out your old SIM card and put in the new SIM card. Now, for this phone, the SIM card is going to be on the left side. You're going to take the pin, and you're going to insert it in the hole and push. Now, if you don't have the tool that came in the box, no problem. Find a paper clip, bend it back. You can use that to pop out the tray. You take this out, you put in your new SIM card, and then it should prompt you to restart the phone. And um, usually after the restart, the phone should light up and show that it has service. All right. Hope you guys found this helpful. If it was, hit that like button down below. If you're not already a subscriber, hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos. Take care and as always, have a good one.